If you guys want to be in with a chance of winning this Resurrectionist emblem, simply drop a like on the video and leave a comment. What is going on guys? Today I bring you another Destiny 2 video. Now earlier today we got an official promotional image from Bungie revealing Destiny 2. The hype for it has kind of subsided a little now. Well not really, I am still super fucking hyped as I know many of you guys are too. Now at the moment this is all we have which is actually official. Earlier in the week we had this leaked image which also reveals a different kind of poster look to Destiny 2. This thing however has not been confirmed to be legit by Bungie as of yet. The poster released by Bungie today though is a completely different kind of theme to what we saw last week. The one we saw last week is kind of more of a COD style poster. Now I'm not saying this was their aim, if it is a legit poster or not. Trying to attract COD players maybe, who knows, COD is dead in my opinion. And I know many people have already switched from it, but that's another story, one we don't really care about here. But this poster Bungie released earlier, which is seen on screen now, this image is way darker in theme than the one leaked last week. This image shows the last city being lit the fuck up. Actually, the poster leaked last week also shows kind of a city in ruins in the background, so it could be the same thing, who knows. Now, there is one main theory what this could mean, and I'll go through it with you. Do you guys remember way, way back where there was a leak via Amazon? Basically, Amazon accidentally leaked three new mega block building sets. Only one really is important here as it coincides with what people believe may be the story behind Destiny 2. So the leak was a Mega Bloks Cabal Bruiser battle building set. In this set you got a buildable hangar platform where you could set the scene for a clash between a Bruiser's crushing strength and a Master Swordsman's skill. A legendary warrior faces his greatest contest yet in the tower hangar. Wielding his raised lighter, hero of the crucible Lord Chax prepares to pit his blade against the furious cleavers of a Kabul Red Guard. Now this listing was quickly removed from Amazon and it's the reason behind many people believing the Kabul attacked the tower and the last city on earth and this is the main story behind Destiny 2. Now at the time of this Amazon leak it was all speculation. Some people believed it, some people dismissed it. But now it's more like the pieces of the puzzle are building up to actually this being the main plot behind Destiny 2's story. In the poster last week we see a guardian wearing what could be Suros armour. But the shape of it and the colour scheme, maybe, just maybe, is Cabal Red Guard armour. Who knows? Now set your minds back to August last year, maybe even further than that. Do you guys remember these images being dropped on the internet? They showed what many believed were early concepts of Destiny 2. I'm pretty sure at the time Bungie were quick to jump on these and fob us off with crazy excuses, which most people believed. Now though it seems there's more to these images. Each one of these images as dark as the official poster released today. And check this out. It isn't too dissimilar to the one that actually dropped today. Definitely look like they fell from the same tree for sure. That looks like the last city up in flames. And this was something, this was an image released last year. Then we see these images on screen which could be three new subclasses. At the time of these being released, not many people bought into them. Me being one of them. I ain't gonna lie to you guys. We see what looks to be a hunter wielding a spear, a titan holding a shield, and a warlock with a sword. What if these images are early concepts of Destiny 2 and these are subclasses for us to look forward to? It makes more sense now than it ever did. But hey, it's all speculation at the moment and nothing has been confirmed by Bungie. Last thing to talk about is this image here, which is official by the way. This one being Bungie's Facebook or Destiny's Facebook header. It shows what looks to be two travellers, as many people are speculating about. Now there are definitely two spear shaped fucking objects right here for sure. I know what this is, it confirms Bungie's official title for Destiny 2. It will be called Destiny 2 The Ball Has Dropped. Now joking aside, what could this be? In my opinion what it is or most likely is, the image and the spear behind maybe are a underlay to the poster we saw shared everywhere with the traveller and that number two on top of it. If that ain't the case, well then you'll be damned if I know what the fuck this is. I could speculate, but when I do, I normally make myself look stupid. Apart from the times like when I predicted the exotic fate bringer. Wink face. But yes guys, let me know what you think about this down below in that comment section and all this craziness. Thanks as always for stopping by, do drop a like, I do appreciate the support, and as always guys I will have you covered if anything new drops, so subscribe if you're new around here, turn on the notifications so you never miss a video, and I will catch you on that next one.
we stand.